Okay, we're gonna draw some seashells. You're gonna need a Sharpie marker, a shell, a pencil, and a drawing sheet. I've chosen this shell. The first thing I'm gonna do is write my name at the bottom and the teacher code with the grade level. And I'm gonna look at my shell and see if I can see some shapes out of it. Sometimes it helps if you take your finger and run it along this shell so you can kind of draw. I'm gonna start with this basic shape here. So it's kind of, and I'm gonna to try to use my space here. This comes out like this and it goes to a point. Then I have some smaller ridges coming up like this. And I like to draw lightly at first. Has some points. We have some lines here. And then I can trace over it and get a little bit darker when I'm done. So now I can take my Sharpie and trace over my lines. I'm not sure I like these lines here, and that's okay. I can go ahead and erase them. Or if I or I can leave them and I'll just draw over them, but I kind of have these little lines like that. Give it a little texture because I can see these lines coming in here. Now I can go ahead and get my chalk. I see I have some whites and some browns and some grays. I might want to start with my lightest color first just to give it a base. I'm actually using the side of my chalk and giving it a light dusting. I can go ahead and take my finger and I take one finger. I don't like to use multiple because this will keep um, other fingers clean if I need them. I can go ahead and get some darker. I see some darker lines in here, down by the tip. Go ahead and blend those, do little circles. I'm gonna find a medium brown just to bring that in so it's not so contrasty. And that kind of blends the lighter with the darker. Maybe put a little bit in here with the lines. Following the shape so it looks like I'm getting some form and form is just kind of the um, to show that it's actually three-dimensional and not flat I might even want to get just a little bit of red in there I like how I left it light in the middle to show some highlight you can show some highlights and shading, and that's what will help you with your form a little bit more. And that's how you do a chalk pastel shell.